Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you like Amazon and you keep shopping there, I know we all have that addiction, hit the like button. If you don't, you can hit the dislike button and subscribe to me anyway, check it out. I, what we do here is do a lot of reviews on different things. We buy from Amazon, from buy, buy from other thing, places. We Just things we use, use around the house and love. We do reviews for those and let you guys know whether we love them or not, basically. Um, not everything we review we do like. Some things, I'm just telling you that it's always your money. That's the truth of it. Uh, but what I have here is some things that I can't live without in this house because I've gotten used to them and they do make my life a lot easier. Um, this over here, if you are making one cup of loose leaf tea and you don't want to put it right in the cup so you want to be able to take it out when you're done like especially with that cilion uh, tea that uh we make it's a little bit got a little bit more body and tastes a lot better when you get it loose leaf tea i'll leave a link to it below i'll leave a link to all this stuff below uh for you to get to them easily um this one here what you do is the one i have i got in a pack of three get it out you can open it up by squeezing over here, put the tea in it, shut it, put the hot water in your glass, stick this in. Once it's as dark as you want it, take it out and throw out what's in it, wash it up. Now, if you're making tea in a pot for more than one person, if you're making a small to a medium one, medium one and fill it up halfway, this one, I need to get some new ones because these are getting pretty stained because I do use them a lot. Uh, so you fill it halfway because the tea is going to expand. Close it up. Put it in a pot with the boiling water. And here you go. Now, if you're making a large pot, I would use two of those and put them in there. Makes the clean out of the pot a lot easier with a loose tea. All right. Let's move on to what I need, what I need when I'm doing my uh, windows, my mirrors, things like that. My son likes to put his hands everywhere, so I'm using these a lot. Instead of using uh, paper towels, the paper towels tend to leave streaks. Uh, I get these off Amazon also. What are they? Right here. I get them by the, what is this, a dozen? I get them by this dozen. They do last forever. This is the second time I bought them in over a year. Um, comes like this, spray the glass, wipe the glass down, um, and you shouldn't have any streaks after you've used this. No streaks, quick cleanup, do the whole house with one rag, throw it in the wash, you're done. Now, we move on to the rags. Great rags, you use them for everything. Floors, counters, everything. They come in multi-color, they come in a pack of 50. They're very affordable. I'll leave a link below. Um, Amazon prices tend to go up and down a lot, so I can't really give you a price on them. They come in one, two, three, four different colors. You can make one color for the counters, one color for the floors, one color for the wood. So if you wanna, don't want to use things over again, um, sometimes I even do the dusting of the floor instead of using those Swiffer wipes or sweeping up. I'll use those to kind of dust all the floor. They pick up hair, they pick up everything. They pick up everything, everything comes out clean. Uh, and honestly, when I do use the floor, I do toss it. I don't usually, unless I'm using it as a wet rag where I can wash it, where I've already dusted everything. If I'm dusting with it, I just throw it out because I don't want to do all that in my uh, washer. All right, these over here, the drying mats. Uh, 18 by 24, there's two sizes. The one that's 18 by 24, um, I use under my coffee maker, my Keurig coffee maker, and I also have the, uh, I also have, you know, that thing that you put the Keurig pods in it. On top of it, I'll take a picture, also leave it in the video. It comes like this, these are very nice, I like them. Um, they have different colors and patterns that you can get. I'll leave a link below, like I said. And then I use for the smallest pots that I need these, because not only do I use them for the Keurig, I also use them to dry the dishes. I use the big ones for those, but then if I need to put my mixer or something on the counter and I don't want to put it straight on my granite, then I put this one under it. This one over here, which is the smaller one. This one is a little bit of a lighter color. And this one is the 16 by 18.
Lots of great stuff, huh? Lots of great stuff. My lemon and lime, I do have a video of this. I will link it above um, for you if you want to check it out. Um, lemon, lime, put it in there, squeeze it. It does make it a lot easier sometimes than actually using your hand to squeeze out the lemon and it keeps all the, uh, the seeds from coming out in there and then you have to dig them out. This is great. Instead of having to scrub out a pan when I'm making um, some sort of cake and brownies, this one over here, what I do is, after I'm done, I flip it over, clean it out, let it dry, comes out clean, comes out perfect, easy cleanup, and nothing sticks to it. And you'll have cake that you're trying to scrape up off the pan because it, it just ruined everything the way it looks. Um, if you chop a lot, you need this, okay? It comes with a brush. Um, I don't have the brush right now with me. I'll picture, I'll show you the brush. And it comes with this one and one that's a little bit bigger so you can make the, well, whatever you're chopping up bigger. Stick it in there. Usually you need, it's good getting your brush out. Just give it a little pound, it goes in. Great for getting aggression out. Every time I use it, my husband asks me, what's wrong? I just got these towels. I'm gonna open up right in front of you. Come on, towels. Let's hope they're good. All right. So they come in gray and uh, white, and there's other colors. Everything always has other colors in there too on Amazon. They, they do have multiple co colors. Um, they're pretty thick. They're not bad in thickness. Um, great kitchen towels. Um, I haven't washed them to see how the quality, the reviews say they're great, so I'm guessing they are after the wash. But usually, but from the feel of them, they seem like pretty good towels. Um, yeah, so yeah, I like these too. Check them out. Because it seems like when you're ordering online, it's so hard to find good towels. Um, I always do read the reviews and check what other people are saying. Are they throwing them out after the first use or what's going on with them? And then, Amazon Basics. Amazon likes to get into everything, don't they? There, there's these baking sheets. You're making cookies or something. And you're not using those ooh, silicone pans. And you got the baking sheets here. I haven't used them yet. But easy wash. Put one on top of the pan. Put the cookies on top of it. You don't need a liner that way. Take them out when you're done. Wash them with soap and water, and they come out clean. And of course, when you first get them, wash them with soap and water initially. And uh, easy cleanup. Rather than having cookies stuck on top of a baking sheet again. So thank you for hanging with me with the Amazon Haul Kitchen Edition. These are some of the things I use. There's a lot more stuff. Um, I'll do another haul. If you guys like that, please do hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Let me know what you think. What do you, what's your favorite thing on Amazon you get for your kitchen? Let me know in the comments below and see you guys soon.